Here's an updated look at the pendulum sissy squat with added load. In this case, using Frank Zane Leg Blaster, adding 50 pounds. If you don't have access to this piece of equipment, as most people don't, use a weighted vest or hold a dumbbell in each hand in the hang position or plate across the chest. The key to this is the contrast of the torso leaning back and the tibia approaching parallel at the bottom of the range of motion. And through doing this over the last six weeks, I've noticed that it's, and Doug Brignoli has pointed this out, it's the one third from the bottom part of the range of motion, that bottom right at the one third point as you're coming up where the resistance is at its greatest. And that's optimal for muscle hypertrophy in this in any squat pattern, meaning that you're taking some of the resistance off at the bottom where you're at the greatest disadvantage leverage wise. The belt or the harness gives you that, but then the resistance is greatest where you want it and then it trails off up at the top.